Peter Antonio from Random Stuff and I'm back again with another video sooner than I thought on this new ROM for Mix um, based on Android 6.0. This is also on the LG um, version 30B stock kernel of course and um, using the Aroma installer makes it a very nice uh, pleasant experience to install the bits and pieces that you want. So let's just quickly have a look at the about phone. And under software info, here are the details of uh, Formix. Um, you know, uh, great credit goes to the uh, Xpirit um, developer um, for having done such a, a great job on this ROM. Now, as most who have followed me have uh, have seen on my previous videos, I've always been a fan of Cloudy, and I've waited and waited for Cloudy to be um, releasing the 2.6 version or even the 3.0, which never happened. And um, you know, I tried the various Cyanogen mods out there with the Nightlies, and uh, although the Cyanogen mod is uh, is faster than this ROM in my opinion, um, very very slick and fast. Um, it doesn't tick all the boxes. However, this Formix ROM uh, does tick every single box, and there's nothing that it doesn't do. Uh, so, with one of the first things that I, you know, uh, look at first um, is the on the dialer. Um, if I if I press the say the voicemail but, um, number there on number one, I just show you my voice will go uh, lower because of the microphone being used for the recording. But I'll just show you, as you can see, I'm presented on the left hand side. As soon as it picks up, I can record. So I do record, and I'm prompted to save or not. The quality of the recording is perfect on both sides, so that is perfect. Another important feature that, um, for me, you know, is uh, is essential is the encryption of uh, documents on the SD card. And um, I made a video where I showed the uh, the problem of not being able to decrypt and encrypt files on the external SD card. Um, but it worked on the internal uh, storage. This is working here as well. Primarily, um, or possibly due to the uh, some of the tweaks that are in uh, Formix, which I can uh, show you, uh, must donate to uh, Formix. If you look on one of these, uh, where is it? Advanced section, okay. Fix internal external SD card, that's the one. It's, um, it's great, great that um, he's even thought of that. The let's have a look at the where is it launcher status bar. Just want to show you the um, the DPI that I'm using. I've reduced the uh, navigation bar size at the bottom from the standard 42 to 30, and on the display you can see that the screen density. I changed it to 513 DPI. I can change that to whatever I want. Now, I don't use a lot of the tweaks in Formix, although um, I've um, I have <laughs> started uh, to contradict myself. I started using them again. Um, I was getting some uh, duplication of uh, icons in the status bar, so I was getting the date twice in there and the and, and the day. So I decided to stop using them in the, in the exposed uh, module. Uh, and uh, use the Formix, which works very fine and without any problems. So, if I go to Tools and show you my exposed installer, the modules that um, that I've downloaded and are working fine at the moment is the Ad Blocker, the App Setting, and the Appy Geek uh, Add Away. Um, as you can see, Gravity Box, the, the most important one for me. Uh, Root Cloak works very well uh, with banking applications so that you can uh, for, for them to, to work. And YouTube uh, background playback is fantastic, especially if you're doing uh, uh, you know, sending of uh, files to Bluetooth players where you can turn the screen off and it will continue. Uh, some of the other modules that um, I need to add on here are the, uh, uh, the boot manager uh, module, possibly the x and the X-Toast. I'm looking at those as well. The version of the framework is the latest 79 and it works perfectly there's nothing that uh, can be said about that the smoothness is um, is very good you know as you can see my 300 odd pages uh, 
This is uh, 5 by 6 and there's uh, over 10 pages down there, so that's over 300. Um, my titanium backups, if I just go into titanium, one of the favorite apps that I use, you can see um, if I do batch actions just to show you how many applications I back up and the phone can handle it absolutely no problem no problem at all there is um, you know, no lag no real lag occasionally I might get something but there's nothing to really put me off you know 422 apps as you can see there and I need to back up some new ones that I've uh, put in there um, yeah so if I what else can I show you the you know, you're all familiar with the uh, stock um, icons and uh, settings here. They're all pretty good. I've turned off Wi-Fi and uh, data and sync so that I don't get any messages as I'm recording. Quick remote works perfectly, as you can see there. Uh, I do have Peel uh, down there, which is uh, another good remote. And um, one of the other things that I love about the stock ROMs is the the fact of the camera being so good. So if I if I look at um, say this is supposed to be here, you know, I can take a picture. The laser focus fine, and it works really well. I've tried different um, cameras in Cyanide Mod um, the 13, the Nightly's. I tried the Snapdragon one, which um, looks really great. It works really nice. Um, the only problem I found was that recording videos would not um, continue when I paused them, so that that was quite annoying. Um, I tried also the uh, the HTC M9 camera, which was pretty good, and I did particularly love the um, the, the gallery uh, app that they have, which gives the animation on the uh, on the video uh, thumbnails. Um, also, on as far as the um, galleries, uh, you know, because you, you can turn them off. Uh, Quick Pick, I think, was the other one that was really good. But there's, there's quite a few. Shazam is now my default one for songs that I hear instead of uh, Soundhound. Although Soundhound is um, is still very good. Um, so the reason, um, just to, to explain why I decided to, to let, let go of, uh, of Cloudy is, is primarily due to the, to the version of, uh, of the ROM being uh, 5.0 Lollipop. Um, 2.6 and 3.0 didn't come so I had to find another solution and I was uh, starting to sort of uh, accept that I would have to live without some of my um, crucial um, elements. Uh, which Sirenjid Mod did not have, being you know the core record didn't work, or didn't work for me. The camera wasn't perfect. Uh, there was no FM radio uh, native. Uh, whilst on this one here, you do at the top as you can see there. And um, but the, the the thing that really um, made me change the, the the ROM was the fact that. You know, I wanted to be on 6.0. I wanted to uh, have these latest uh, fixes to the battery, you know, the doze and and, the, and all the rest of it. Uh, the battery performance is a lot better than um, than it was on Cloudy, um, but n not not much better than it was on uh, Sunshine Mod. The basically when I'm not doing much on it, for example, sleeping. Um, I, it's not unusual for me to see 1% being used in three hours so that's that's pretty good and overall everything works nothing no, nothing to say the um, the encryption of uh, files works absolutely fine whether it's on internal or external as mentioned so yeah this is um, this is a, this is really a perfect ROM I don't know what else I can can add if there's any Questions you have, just put them down below, and we'll try and answer them uh, myself or anybody else who's uh, uh, watching and, uh, and reading the comments can help to um, to answer your questions. So I hope this has helped. Give it a try. Uh, Full Mix ROM is definitely, you know, for me the new Cloudy, and um, yeah, it's uh, fantastic. I hope that they come out with all the new. Uh, uh, well, there is the OTAs. Um, if I just show you on. About phone, you can see that you've got software updates and app updates. But the software updates, are hopefully, over, over the air, uh, we should be able to get any um, uh, releases like 6.01 if that comes out. But 
the Formix ROM for me absolutely rocks. And uh, um, one of the things that, um, as you know, I'm not going to mention anything else. Thanks for watching, everyone. Until the next one. Cheers.